things really piled up while I was gone. Ta-da! Hello, Shadi Bays. Hello, besties. Welcome to another book haul video. Um, yeah, hold on. When I sip the coffee, words come out better, you know? So Shadi Bays, as some of you may know, a little tradition we all have as the besties that we are is opening books together. Every time I get packages, I usually leave them all out and then open it in a big video, correct? Correct, okay. So the last time I did that was like two months ago, but let me explain. When I filmed that video, it was posted two months ago, but I filmed it in November. I know, I know, hold on. <laughs> I filmed it in November, but then I left to visit family for the holidays and I was gone for several months. So I wasn't able to get that video to you until the time that I posted it, right? Within that time, other books arrived and it started piling up, but I hadn't gotten the other video to you yet. So I wanted to do that first before I opened these. So here we are. <laughs> The reason why they are open is because while I was gone, the lovely people in my apartment complex were bringing it up for me so that it didn't just stay out there. But for sanitary purposes and COVID and all of that, when I got home, I opened it with gloves, the boxes, because there were so many people touching it. And I was like sanitizing it and unboxing the books. And I didn't want to film that part because what was the point? So this video is going to be a little different than the other unboxing videos we've had. It's just going to be me showing you the books that people have sent me and reading the lovely notes because I didn't read the notes yet. I wanted to read it on camera, but that's the reason why this video is a little bit different than usual. Still the same concept. I told you that this video would be a monthly thing, either every month or every two months, depends on how many books I get. I will do a video like this. Where should I start? Should we start this way or should we start that way? What do we think? This way, right? You're right. I'm over here. I grabbed a pile and I was starting with it. I'm really low down here. You're who I'm thinking of. That song's stuck in my head. Girl, you ain't my runner up. Oh my God. Wait, these are the first ones and it's a Penelope Douglas pile. <laughs> okay, okay. Until you. Have you ever been so angry that hitting things felt good? No. <laughs> But clearly you have, sir. Hello? Why is this man shirtless, sir? <laughs> Put a shirt on. Enjoy your gift, Taylor Jackson. Oh, hi Taylor. Thank you so much. Not only for getting me until you, but also for getting me two other Penelope Douglas books too. How beautiful these look together. These are what I'm talking about, okay? This is what I'm talking about. This is the kind of cover I want to see. Falls Boys, I know that this is the kids from the Fall Away series, right? Arrow and Hawk. They're clearly, clearly superhero fans because you've got Arrow, like Green Arrow, and then you've got Hawk, like Hawkeye. I got it. I understood. I understood, Penelope. You don't need to explain. Oh, there's a playlist. <gasps> Nobody move. <laughs> this shit is life and death. What the fuck is the law? I love that song. I love Snow the Product. Just the fact that that song is in the playlist, you got me. And then Shoddy Bay Taylor also got me Misconduct by Penelope Douglas too. I haven't heard a lot about this one. Um, for fans of Colleen Hoover, well, that's me. Oh, it's a single dad. <gasps> you don't need to tell me anything else. Let's look at the playlist. Because I got high by Afro Man. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, Penelope Douglas with the playlist, they just get me every time. I am so very excited to read Misconduct, Falls Boys, and Until You. Thank you so much, Taylor. I'm so, so excited to read this. Because this isn't over. It's uh, about to start. I got It Ain't Me by Tilly Cole. It originally was by Selena Gomez, and then Tilly Cole took over. <laughs> Listen, there's a motorcycle right there. Do you see it? Do you see it? I'm a fan simply because I'm a fan of Jax Teller and that man means everything to me. Therefore, I feel connected every time I see a motorcycle. I'm like, yeah, that's me because I'm Jax Teller's old lady. Many years ago, two children, excuse me. I think it's called the Hades Hangman series or something. I'm, it ain't me, babe. <laughs> the note says, hey babe, I'm a huge Colleen Hoover fan too. Oh, same. And I love your content. I hope you love this book from Sam Scowler. Thank you so much, Sam. Are you joking? Oh, I almost dropped it. I was already so excited to read this, but now I'm even more excited because reading the back and seeing that it has to do with an MC, I'm there. MC? Me. <laughs> Sam, I love you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
This next one, Shoddy Bays, I don't see a lot of people talking about it, but I'm very intrigued. It says, need you to hate me? And I love the cover. I love the little cartoon people at the bottom. I don't know at all what it's about. A passionate and enthralling college romance. Two damaged souls on a path to obliteration. Oh God. Ace is an asshole. There is no denying that. He's rude, arrogant, and impulsive. We love that. Is there a playlist? There isn't. That's upsetting. First of all, how dare you? The note says, hey bestie, you bring us such infectious joy through your videos and book reviews that we wanted to get you a gift. <laughs> Thank you for sharing your passion of reading with us and stay smiling from Malta. It's Kelly and Matt. Oh, thank you so much. Stay smiling. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Thank you so much. You guys bring me so much joy. It's a circle of happiness over here. Now, would you look at this, y'all? Ruin. Ruin by Jolie Vines. I wanted him. He wanted to ruin me. Hence the title. It was the blood I noticed first. What? Dark Island Scots, number one. Oh my God, is this a series? The note says, just finished reading this and it's now one of my favorites. <laughs> that and i cannot wait for the second book this summer enjoy raylan kindler thank thank you <laughs> thank you so much raylan so wait the second one hasn't come out yet because she said this summer it is no summer yet oh my goodness raylan says that it is one of her favorites therefore do we trust it i think we trust it yes i'm ready to be ruined the next two books y'all that i have with me here from the little pile um is fearless king and then the second i know these are both from a series different series though but both from maya hughes second it says she's hated me since da, 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 da. since when oh since the second we met <laughs> I only read the second. It's the second we met. Ooh, what's going on here? What sport is this? The second we met, more like the second I saw this book, I'm intrigued, yes. We have Fearless King, which I think is the Kings of Rittenhouse series. The note in this says, you have the most intoxicating energy, love your videos, never stop being you, and continue to shine from Michelle. Thank you so much, Michelle. What pile should we look at next? I started this way. So now let's go this way. Yeah, let's do it. It ain't me. Okay, so this one is a series, I think. Black Spades. And it came with three. Hi, my name is Jessica and I emailed you before. Oh, and I was able to figure out how to send these books to you. FYI, just in case you didn't read my email. I broke up the email to have it all fit. Oh, wait, Jessica Davis. I did not see it. I did not. Thank you. And I loved this trilogy and I hope you do too. Jessica Davis. Thank you, Jessica. King of Spades. Queen of Fire. Aces and Ashes. Okay. This town was run by violent gangs and I lived a quiet life as the criminal prosecutor's daughter. Oh no. Is this reverse harem? Why? I have one when you can have them all. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> Thank you, Jessica. I love you. This next one, I'm so excited to read y'all. It's Dear Heart, I Hate You by Elia Greenwood. It all started with an ad. House sitter needed for the summer. Guess I missed the part about the cocky basketball player sleeping down the hall. I don't know anything about basketball, but I can still score. Would you give your heart to a monster? Immediately, yes, because I'm thinking Klaus Michelson. I'm so excited to read this, y'all. Dear heart, I hate you. Elia Greenwood. I think there's another one too in the series. Dear love, I love you. That's the song, right? <laughs> the note says, hi, girly. Hope you enjoy this as much as I did. I know you love enemies to lovers and this was so fun. I do love enemies to lovers. I love that you know me so well. You don't need to read this first book to read this because there aren't any spoilers for it. Oh, thank you so much for letting me know because I was just thinking about the first book. Um, she didn't tell me the name though. <laughs> also, thank you for the endless wrecks from Nadia. Thank you, Nadia, for getting me this book. And you're so welcome for the endless wrecks. That is what I'm here for. And now I have a wreck from you. Dear heart, I hate you. Thank you so much. I'm so excited to read this. I love you. Electric Idol by Katie Roberts. Listen, listen. I think this is the second book. I think the first one is Neon Gods. I have Neon Gods, but I have not read it. But now I have Electric Idols, so maybe I should. I love Poseidon. Athena, Aphrodite. There's also a map. In case I was wondering what Olympus looks like in this book, there's a map right here. I can go to the upper city or listen to this. I can go to the lower city. That's nice. Because I love you so much, and this is on my TBR, I'm about to start my first Mariana Zapata book. Yeah. Which one? I love them all so much. It's nice that the birds are chirping outside right now. I love you. Hope you enjoyed this so much from Kylie. Oh, Kylie Rachel. Thank you so much, Kylie. You said it's on your TBR. So did you read it yet? What are the thoughts? Let me know everything. A Greek mythology retelling with spice. I'm pretty interested. I have not read Katie Roberts. Like I think I've read one and it was your dad will do. <laughs> 
I was going through some when I read that. I don't know. Don't ask me questions. Now this next one did not have a note and that is Love and Other Cursed Words by Kristen Becker Ritchie. Listen, you guys know that I am forever grateful for Kristen Becker Ritchie for writing my favorite series of all time, Addicted Calloway. Yes, I have to talk about it in a video once again because if I don't, you'll forget. <laughs> Anyway, so Kristen Becker Ritchie wrote my favorite series. So of course I am gonna read Love and Other Cursed Words. I haven't heard much about it to be honest, but I'm really, really excited. I know it's a sapphic romance, so I love that. She is town royalty, I'm town scum. She's a goddess and ice queen. I just want in and out. You just want in and out like, like the burger place or you just want to get in and out? What? Kristen Becker Ritchie, what did you mean by this? Explain. <gasps> also by Kristen Becker Ritchie, the Addicted to Callaway Sister series, the Bad Rep Duet, the Like Us series. Yes, that is very much by Kristen Becker Ritchie. My babies, I miss them so much. <laughs> I will not have an Addicted to Callaway breakdown. I will not. I already had one today when I saw an edit, okay? I have one every day and I allow myself one a day. One Addicted to Callaway breakdown a day is all I will allow myself to have. I refuse to have another one. So I'm very excited to read this, but whoever got it from me, please let me know who it was because it did not come with a note. Amazon was playing games with me because they didn't give me a note. And I tried to reach out and be like, hello, was there a note? And they were like, no. I love you so, so much. So excited to read this. Thank you for getting it for me. You know, it's cute. There was another one that didn't come with a note too. And that's this one, Irresistible attraction a glance a kiss a touch they'll change you forever it's just the satisfaction of your lips your lips nothing the matter with the kiss I got really carried away there what happened sometimes you meet someone yes Bethany <laughs> thank you thank you thank you I would love to say your name but I don't know who it is should we make up a name for now I love you I love you I love you this one it's from Sapphire Lost 94 and it says, hope you enjoyed this book like my last recommendation, but if not, that's okay too. Uh, you're so sweet. Like, it's so nice that you're like, I hope you enjoy this, but if you don't, it's fine. <laughs> when it's me, I'm like, I hope you enjoy my favorite book, Adika Calloway. If you don't, don't tell me because I will never speak to you again. Hello? It's this book right here in flight. I have flight anxiety. I don't want to read this. <laughs> no, but up in the air, book one. What is this noise? It grabbed me from the start and I loved every second of it. It what? What is this noise? I don't know what's going on out there. It's a good thing I don't go outside. When reserved flight attendant Bianca gets one look, wait, it really, it really do be about planes. <laughs> I have an overwhelming fear of planes. I know, I need to get through it, I really do. The world runs on airplanes, but for some reason, little Larry, she said no. She said you already have so many other mental health things going on. You're also gonna have a huge phobia of planes. I love that for me, honestly. Thank you so much. Shout out to you, big guy. You know, if you can't make fun of yourself, really, what is life all about? When reserve flight attendant Bianca gets one look at billionaire hotel owner James. James. I'm immediately interested because you said billionaire, but it is a J name, so. A little bit of a balancing act there. I'm very excited to read this. Thank you for getting me this Sapphire Lost 94. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you. Hold on, hold on. This next one, are we ready? The third best thing, which is the next one in the series that I got over there. The second. Hi, I sent you Electric Idols earlier in the month. I love you so much and I hope you love this series so I know whether to read it or not. <laughs> <laughs> from Kylie, Kai reads a lot. Thank you so much, Kylie. You did get me Electric Idol, here it is. <laughs> now I have the third. She's the girl next door, he's my secret pen pal. It's giving Punk 57, it's giving Dirty Letters. It's giving a Cinderella story, if we're going that deep. <laughs> Kylie tells me that I need to read this series so that I can tell her if it's good. <laughs> I love that you guys do that. I love that you guys send me books and you're like, Larissa, you read this and then you tell us what you think because we don't wanna read it, so we, you read it and you let me know. <laughs> And honestly, I'm here for it. Thank you so much, not only for this one, but also for Electric Idol, just for existing, honestly, just for being a shoddy bae. I love you. Thank you so much, Kylie. This next one is a series, and I know who got it for me already. It's my shoddy bae, Maria, because I know she loves this series. Come back to me, stay with me, run away with me, watch over me. Okay, I had to get the rest of them for you for Christmas. It's only right. I love you. I hope you love the series as much as I do. <laughs> I love Maria so much. I didn't see the first one on your list, but this series is one of my top five contemporary romance reads. This one specifically, I love you. You didn't see the first one because I think I already have the first one. I want to say I could be wrong. No, I'm not wrong. I do have it. Now I have the rest. I'm so excited for this series because Maria says amazing things about it. Pretty much have the same taste. I feel like all of us shoddy bays have the same taste. So most of the time when I like a book, you guys like a book. And then when you guys like a book, I do too. It's like we have this vibe going on. We have this mutual trust, correct? I feel like we do. Yes. Don't, don't lie. Don't lie, we do have this mutual trust. 
right? I'm very excited to read this. Thank you so much, Maria. I love you with all my heart. This note just proves the thing I told you in the beginning of this video, how I explained that I wasn't home, so I wasn't able to open these. It proves that because these were for Christmas. I wasn't home. I wasn't home, you guys. What do you want me to do? Come back on a plane? I don't think so. I'm so excited. Thank you, Maria. I love you so, so much. Mwah! Oh, my camera's dying. That's cute. My camera may or may not have low-key died, but I'm back. Everything's fine. You didn't see anything. Y'all, Running Wild by K.A. Tucker. The cover sort of matches me right now. Hi, Larry. I love your videos so much. Your smiles are contagious. <laughs> You're the reason I found Mariana Zapata, one of my new favorite authors. Yeah. So I wanted to repay the kindness with a fave of my own. Hope you enjoy from Cassidy. Thank you so much, Cassidy. Are you kidding? My smile is contagious. <laughs> Thank you so much, Cassidy. I love you. I love you. I love you. <laughs> These next two, I will say I'm excited, okay? But hear me out. I am a little bit scared as well. It is this. Is it called a cat and mouse duet? I think this is called the cat and mouse duet, but don't quote me on it. Don't write it down. I'm not sure. Haunting Adeline is the first one. And then Hunting Adeline is the second one. I know it's like about a stalker. Cat got your tongue, little mouse. Okay, it is the cat and mouse duet. I have discovered due to context clues. What are their names? Well, obviously her name is Adeline. The dedication on Hunting Adeline, ready? To my anxiety because you really tried me on this one and I kicked your ass anyway. Yeah! I love it. The note came in Haunting Adeline. Haunting Adeline did not come with a note. So if you got me this, please let me know. Thank you so much for this. I'm very excited to read this duet. I think this is the second one, like I said. Yes. Uh, oh my gosh, she's thick or whatever. What? Oh my god, they are both so thick. Hi, Shari Bay. You always add to my TBR, so it's only fair that I get you a book from yours. You are my fave account on TikTok and inspire me to make my own book talk account one day. <gasps> Love you and enjoy the read. From Shailene or Sita. Thank you so much. Shailene, are you joking? Make your book talk account as you should. Anyway, I'm so excited to read the cat and mouse duet. Like I said, I'm excited slash nervous because I did hear it's about a stalker. And that's like, how are we gonna make that hot? You know what I mean? I can manipulate the emotions of anyone who lets me. Me. I'll make them hurt, make you cry, make you laugh and sigh. Okay, Dr. Seuss. And I can never look away, not when I want him to come closer. Okay. So he's a stalker, but she likes it. She wants to be the stalky. Is that a word? I feel like it's not. English is not my first language. I feel like this duet is very much gonna test me. Let's see. I'm excited. The cat mouse duet. Thank you so much, Shailene. And thank you to whoever got me the second one as well. I love you dearly. I don't know why I said dearly. I have never said that before. But you know what? It's a new thing. I just I just started and I'm gonna I'm gonna carry on my wayward son. This next one seems interesting, okay? It's called The Doctor. It already has one of my favorite things. A rich man. He's confident, experienced, seductive, and he's my ex-boyfriend's father. I love, I love ex-boyfriend's dad, honestly. Cause that's just the motto, you know what I mean? He does you wrong, you fuck his dad. I don't make the rules. You make his father a daddy. <laughs> says, hi, there have been many books that you recommend that I loved. I only trust you. So before I read this book, I want to hear your review as it is the only opinion that matters. <laughs> From Tierra at the turkey leg. We love the turkey leg. The best part of the turkey. <laughs> McSteamy? McDreamy? Who we got here? I don't know, but I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Tiara. I will let you know if this book is good. I will read it. Thank you, Tiara. Now, this one did not come with a note. Once again, again. <laughs> Dangerous Temptation by Gianna Darling. Whoever got me this, thank you so much. Oh, a playlist! You got the power over me. This one I feel like I'm gonna read ASAP, and it's Happily Letter After by V. Keeland and Penelope Ward. My love story all started with a letter, only it wasn't from the man I'd eventually fall in love with. It was from his daughter. Did you say single father? Oh, <laughs> say no more. I've seen what I needed to see. Immediately, yes. The note says, hi, my name is Nona. Hi, Nona. And you're one of my favorite book talkers. You make me laugh every time I watch you. You're reading with me vlogs. And overall, you make my day. I hope you enjoy the book and I hope you have a great Christmas from Nona. Thank you so much, Nona. I'm so excited to read it and I'm so glad that I can make you laugh. I can make you smile. That honestly means the world to me. Thank you so much, Nona. I love you. These next two were sent by my angel, Kai. She wrote, enjoy your gift. I also sent you the Zodiac Academy. Thank you so much, Kai. So she got me American Prince and part of the Zodiac Academy. And here's the thing, American Prince, I think is part of the new Camelot trilogy. I don't know anything about the new Camelot trilogy. I just realized that. I was trying to think of like what it's about. I don't know. I could not tell you. Same with the Zodiac Academy though, to be honest. So thank you so much, Kai, for sending it to me. <laughs> 
mixtape by Britney C. Cherry, y'all. It says, I was always an avid mystery murder thriller reader before. I'm a creature of habit and don't usually go outside my box, but your videos pushed me and I'm forever grateful I've discovered a new genre that I love from Jessica Davis. Thank you so much, Jessica. I'm so glad to be help you. Hello? <laughs> I'm so glad to be able to help you start a new genre. Thank you so much for getting me the mixtape because I loved this book, okay? I listened to it on Audible and it was amazing. It was fucking incredible. I loved it. So I'm so glad to own it now because I want to annotate. Two songs, same melody. Y'all, I love this book. For sure, search up trigger warnings if you're gonna read it because it is kind of heavy. Thank you so much, Jessica. I love you. Listen, Miss Lucy, you got me this, okay? And you wrote I hope you love this book. It's the intimacy experiment. It is a very known thing by you guys that I have not read The Roommate yet, which is really embarrassing. I know I've been meaning to read it for so long. Now I have the second one. It's not like the second one in this series, but I know that it's like, I think you should read The Roommate first and then this one, even though they're not connected. I still wanna go with The Roommate first. You know what I mean? So as soon as I read The Roommate, I will read this, but I'm embarrassed that I haven't read it yet. <laughs> Naomi and Ethan. Did you watch 90210 Miss Rosie Danan? 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 Did you watch it? Yes or no? Tell me the truth. I love cartoon covers. Superior. Thank you so much, Lucy. Once I read The Roommate, I will read this. <laughs> I just gotta read The Roommate first, you know what I mean? Eventually. Hi, Larissa. As always, you know I love you and your content. Happy holidays from your shoddy bae. Karina Mia underscore. Things I wanted to say but never did. And I did. I read it just now. I think like last week I read it. So thank you so much for getting it for me so that I could read it. I love you, Karina. Happy holidays to you too. It's technically Easter. So holiday nonetheless. <laughs> so this is by Christina Lauren, okay? And it's called Sweet Filthy Boy. I have not heard much about these. The note says, I hope you love this. I've been wanting to read this series too. Love all your videos and you're one of my faves from Jessica. Thank you so much, Jessica. Honestly, like, it makes my heart grow a couple inches. What is it? How does the Grinch thing happen? Grow a couple sizes, not inches. <laughs> what happens in Vegas ends up in Paris? What? Oh, I don't think that's how the saying goes. Mia Holland is a usually one for a fling, but after a sweet, filthy night with a charming Frenchman, okay, she makes the wildest decision of her life. She rolls the dice and follows him to France for the summer. This girly said, I'm gonna sleep with this man in Vegas, and you know what? I'm gonna follow him to Paris. I don't care. I support the audacity, girly. I support it. I have to, because if you're gonna go ahead and do that, from a one night stand, I have to support it because you just have such courage. You are so brave. Interesting concept. Thank you so, so much, Jessica. Love you. Now this, I have not heard anything about, okay? Delirium. It's by Lauren Oliver and it says, dare to love. Now it says, hey, how are you, Shadi Bay? Hey, I'm doing well. How are you? I'm Fabiola. I just moved to the US from Venezuela and you with your videos makes me so happy and you help me start reading again. I love you. So I give you my first favorite book. I hope you like it from Fabiola Arias. Thank you so much, Fabiola. I hope you are enjoying America. <laughs> I also moved to the United States from Brazil. So I know the feeling of coming to a new country and being like, what the fuck? <laughs> it's Fabiola's first favorite book. So we're gonna have to just give it a shot. You know what I mean? Give it a shot, give it an opportunity, one chance, one shot, m and &M. Kind of gives a little bit of a dystopian vibe. Thank you so much, Fabiola. I love you, I love you. I hope you are doing amazing. Legs are falling asleep, hold on. So how are you guys doing? <gasps> Pause everything. I love this book. <gasps> Let's read the note immediately. I love you with all my heart and I mean that in the most dramatic way possible. <laughs> The way I was just dramatic when I saw this book. You are the reason I have gotten back into reading and any book you recommend I know is gonna be good. From Tiffany and I am becoming a brand new person with this book in my hands. I love The Bride Test. Thank you so much for getting this for me, Tiffany. You have no idea what you've done. You have no idea the monster you've created. The monster. The monster you've created because I am now a brand new bitch with this book in my hands. Like really, I can't have a bad day when I started off with Megan Thee Stallion. So I've been going on a Taylor Jenkins read binge lately and I've pretty much read her entire backlist except for this one. So I'm so excited to read it, Forever Interrupted. The story seems interesting, okay? It's about this woman, Elsie Porter, and she like meets this man and they fall in love or whatever. Nine days later, he like gets hit by a truck and dies. Now that I think about it, this doesn't sound that good at all. <laughs> So thankful for your TikTok and YouTube videos. Your energy has brought so much joy into my life. Can't wait to hear what you think of this book. Enjoy from Rachel. Rachel, thank you so much. Rachel or Raquel, thank you for watching the videos. Thank you for enjoying them. Like, honestly, none of this would be anything if it wasn't for you guys. So thank you. <gasps> Nightfall. 
It was the last book I needed in the Devil's Night series and now I own it. I have it in my hands. Here it is. This book is hella big, y'all. Come on. The cover is interesting. It looks like a little carnival ride. I think the one I'm the most excited to read is Kill Switch and Nightfall. I'm very interested in Damon and Will, you know? It says, this is the best out of the bunch in my opinion. Please enjoy your buddy read with bros from Bryn. Thank you so much, Bryn. I'm so excited. Bros and I are so excited to start this series, honestly. I love you. You know that already, but I love you. Wait, y'all, I got some more Tilly Cole. It's Scarred Souls, Raise and Reap. It's a dark mafia romance, and I've only read the first one, but this book includes the first and the second from the series. Hope you like them from Melissa. Okay. I've heard a lot about Tilly Cole, and I have another book here by Tilly Cole. It's at the bottom of the pile, but it was the It Ain't Me Babe. Um, so I am excited to read it. Isn't that one that wrote A Thousand Boy Kisses? I haven't read A Thousand Boy Kisses because I don't want pain, but I have it, so maybe I should read it eventually. <laughs> But thank you, Alyssa. Thank you so much. I'm very excited to read this. Nobody move. It's Dead Man Walking. It's Dead Man Walking, which is the last book I think I needed from The Fallen Men. Oh my God. A killer, a criminal, a psychopath. Yes, say no more. I'm so excited for Fallen Men. I know that a new one is coming out. I want to say this month. I may be wrong on that. Don't write it down. I am so excited. Let's read the new. Just saw your most anticipated books of 2022 video and I heard you're excited for book seven in this series, even though you still need to read it. <laughs> We love rainy days, don't we, babe? We love rainy days, don't we, babe? Why the hell do you have to bring that up? <laughs> Jocelyn, why would you bring this up at such a happy moment in my life right now? That's nice. Jocelyn, thank you so much. You're right, this is one of my most anticipated reads of this year. Fallen Men in general, I can't wait because I told you I was obsessed with Jax Teller. You guys know that's literally the only reason I'm excited for this. So much Jocelyn. We love rainy days, don't we, baby? I can't believe you said that. I'm gonna forget it. I'm gonna ignore it. Now I have another Gianna Darling book, and that is When Heroes Fall. I told you guys I read this on my Kindle and I loved it, so I'm so excited to have the physical copy of it. I haven't read the second one though, and I think that's when villains rise. That's the duet's name. Anti-heroes in love. Got it. it. Says hi Larissa, because of your content, I've read eight books this last month. Thank you for sparking my love for reading and romance again from Jana. Thank you so much, Jana. Jenna? Jenna. Jana. Thank you, Jana. I love this book. I'm so excited to have the physical copy. It's really important to me to have physical copies. I like to collect things. Like, I'm a very big collector. A lot of people ask me what I do with my books after I read them. I keep them because I want to have a huge library one day. I've collected things ever since I was little. I literally have a bunch of DVDs behind me, like of TV shows I love. I don't use a fucking DVD. Neither does anybody else. I like to own them physically for some reason. Thank you so much. I don't know why I was saying all that. I was explaining something. What was it? I don't recall. Anyway, thank you so much, Jana. I'm so excited to read the second one in this series and I'm so excited to own this one now too. Ah, thank you. Hey, Larissa, Hazel is Jess from New Girl. First of all, one of my favorite shows of all time. I will take no arguments. New Girl is the best comedy there is. I said what I said. Thanks for always giving us the sun, even in our darkest days from Kate. I may cry. I really, really may right here, right now, start sobbing. What do we think about that? Kate, I love you. Giving us the sun in our darkest days. Feeling like Daisy Calloway right now. I can be Daisy Calloway and then you guys can be Reg Meadows. What do we think about that? I'm really emotional over that. Thank you. <laughs> Y'all, these next ones, I'm so excited to read. I can't express how excited I am. It's this series right here. The fourth one, my bestie Ju just got it for me. So I do have it, but it's in my bookshelf. <laughs> um, but this is book one two and three, I think. So it's The Predator, The Reaper, and The Emperor. Doesn't that look so good? The Predator, The Reaper, <laughs> The Emperor. Emperor Palpatine? What happens when an unstoppable force meets an immovable object in the field of death? Oh no, tell me. I saw that you have my favorite mafia romance series ever on your wish list and I had to send it to you. I make everyone I know read this series from Gabby. Wait, wait, Gabby, it's mafia? What? I'm so excited to read this. Thank you, Gabby. I love that it's your favorite series. So I feel like I can trust it. You know what I mean? Like I can trust the judgment. My legs are dying. This next book looks beautiful. I've never seen it before. The Sight of You. It looks gorgeous with all the birds on the cover. Hi, hello. I wanted to say thanks because your videos always fill my TBR with new books and I wanted to repay the favor. This is one of my favorites. And even though it made me cry for hours, I hope you enjoy it anyway from Kate. <laughs> 
Kate, what do you mean I made you cry for hours? Hey, I'm not emotionally stable. I'm so excited though, it looks beautiful. The side of you, it does look like it could be very sad, but as long as it has a happy ending, I feel like I'll be okay. Thank you, Kate. I love reading your favorite books, honestly. That makes me so happy. This next note says, hey Larissa, I decided to send you the first book from my all-time favorite book series. I hope you enjoy it as much as I did. I enjoy watching your videos. You're the highlight of my day. All the way from Sweden, love Ida. <gasps> Thank you so much, Ida. I love that, from Sweden. It's Until Friday Night by Abby Glass. I have not read the series. Ida from Sweden. Thank you so much. If it's your favorite series, I feel like I have to enjoy it. And if I don't enjoy it, I won't tell you because I know that it'll hurt your feelings. Just like it would hurt mine if you told me you didn't like Addicted Calloway. So it wouldn't even hurt my feelings. I just would never speak to you again. <laughs> this next one is really important. Are we ready? It's the Madison Kate series. I have the first book and I want to say it's called Hate. And now I have Liar, Fake, and Kate. And I know that it's reverse harem, so <laughs> I'm there. Hi, Bestie. I've been obsessed with your TikToks and YouTube and my TBR name was on wishlist. Hate you for it. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed these books. I love them all, especially the MK series. Here's another message because Amazon keeps cutting me off. Any book I see your rec is an instant buy and I'm not mad about it. <laughs> Elian, you're the reason I started a bookstore. Kayla Ray reads. Thank you so much, Kayla. She says that the Madison Kate series is one of her favorites. So therefore I will listen deeply because I've been excited to read this series for quite some time. And I know that the spinoff is apparently even better, which is the Haiti series. So I'm so, so excited to get to these. Thank you so much for getting it for me, Kayla. The fact that I was able to inspire you to start a bookstagram, that makes me so happy. I don't have a bookstagram personally. My Instagram is just kind of I post a little bit of everything, so I don't have one, but it seems like a lot of work and like the aesthetics are beautiful and I love everybody's bookstagram. I'm not aesthetic enough to be able to make one of those, but you know what? Let me follow you on there. Where's my phone? Phone, hello. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know where my phone is, but I will follow you on there as soon as I get my phone. <laughs> I feel like I'm also getting tired, so we should jam up for a second to like get the energy back, right? <laughs> Now we are ready to proceed. This one says, I mean, duh, I had to get this for you, babe. I love you so much, Maria. I love Maria. I love Maria. I don't have words to describe how much I love her. She's fabulous. Thank you so much. It's Ignite. Y'all know I love Ignite so much. I read it on my Kindle. I told you guys that. I told you I fell in love with it. I want to binge more of Melanie Hollow's books because of that, because of how much I love Ignite. Thank you so much, Maria, for getting me the physical copy. I know Maria loves Melanie Harlow, so it makes sense why she would get me this. <laughs> She's like pushing the Melanie Harlow agenda. Thank you. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all, this is really important. It's Real by Kennedy Ryan. It's like an actress that's in Broadway and a very famous film director sees her there and they start working together because he's amazed by her talent. And obviously, you know, she's amazed by his too. And then they get amazed by each other's everything else. <laughs> I'm so excited. This seems like a beautiful book. Look at the cover. Say it ain't so. It's gorgeous. I've heard amazing things about this book. Added it to my cart too. Enjoy. Love your content. BTW. You're, you're awesome. From Brett underscore Robson. Thank you so much, Brett. Honestly, like the fact that I'm going to be reading a book, you're also going to be reading that book. I'm so excited. We're going to be buddy reading it. Technically, if you think about it. Thank you so much, Brett. I'm so excited to read real. These next ones are a series and I want to say it's called the Stay With Me series. It's this. Stay With Me, even when I'm gone, now open your eyes in that order. That's the trilogy. I think it's a trilogy at least. <laughs> me with everything. I think, but I'm not sure. Green eyes, tattoos. <gasps> you have me at tattoos. I hope you love this series as much as I do. Love you, Queen Shadi Bay from Maya. Thank you. Maya. I feel like I will love this series. It sounds like I will. Hey Larissa, the Stay With Me trilogy are three of my all-time favorite books. It is the Stay With Me trilogy. I am so wise. I hope you love Ollie as much as I do from Alyssa. And then the last note is also from Alyssa. It says, I read Darling Venom because of you. <gasps> I love Darling Venom so much. Search a Prigger Wines if you read Darling Venom, but it is one of the best books I've ever read in my all time. It's become one of my all time favorites. That makes me so happy. I also read Still Beating, which was amazing. And I love your TikTok so much. It never fails to make me smile from Alyssa. Still Beating and Darling Venom I'm, are some of my all time favorite books. So I'm so glad you read them and that you enjoyed them because that makes me so happy, Alyssa. Thank you for getting this from me. Alyssa and Maya, the Stay With Me trilogy. I ain't never had a chase dick in my life. I'm so excited to read this. I feel like this is gonna fuck me up though. It kind of seems like it's a little bit sad. Dana Vipers. I, uh, um. <laughs> Kayla also got me this one and she wrote, <laughs> get this, ready? If you like a good knife kink, you'll love this one. I have heard things about this book, definitely things. Ryder, Garrett, Kenzo, and Diesel. Diesel. <laughs> they said, dame la gasolina. <laughs> Thank you so much for getting this for me, Kayla. 
that. This note says, I wanted to thank you for all your positivity and how much you make me laugh. I know you love romance books, so I thought I would send you my favorite series that got me into reading from Megan. Thank you so much, Megan. I love when you guys send me your favorite series and favorite books. It's the breathing series. It goes reason to breathe, barely breathing, and out of breath. I have never heard of this, but I'm so excited to read it since it's your favorite series, Megan. I do love me some romance. I do, I do. Colleen Hoover, heartbreaking yet heartwarming ending to a series that captivated me from start to finish, Colleen Hoover. Wow, Colleen says it's amazing. Therefore, I have to believe it's amazing. I trust Colleen with my entire heart. You guys know this. The breathing series. I love taking breaths. I feel like it's very important to breathe, you know? Or else you'd be hella dead. The Element series by Brittany C. Cherry. The air he breathes. The fire between high and low. The silent waters. And then the last one is the gravity of us. Ooh, this one seems really good. I think it's all different books, like following different couples. So like interconnected standalones kind of vibe. I'm very excited to read the Element series, y'all, because as I told you, I read the mixtape and I loved that. So Brittany C. Cherry already owns my heart. I already trust her deeply. Hey, Larissa, thank you for bringing so much light in a world that could be so dark sometimes. I don't think you understand that you can't say things like that to me and expect me not to sob. <laughs> You can't say I'm a light in a dark world and expect me not to cry uncontrollably, okay? You are a true gem, brings so much laughter to so many of us who adore you. You're the real deal, Katie. And then she also wrote a note that says, I was in a reading slump forever and found you and found my love for reading. I can always trust your opinion. Thank you, your bestie, Katie. Katie, are you joking? I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Katie. That note, it may have done things to me. I may have to go lay in bed after this and cry. I'm so excited to read the Element series. Thank you so much. I hear amazing things about this series, honestly, so I'm very excited. Thank you. Thank you, Katie. I love you. Y'all, Kingdom of the Curse. I love this cover. It's beautiful and it's hardcover too. Hi, Lois. I just finished Kingdom of the Wicked, so I knew I had to get this for you. I absolutely adore your videos. You've got me hooked on Mariana Zavada. As I should. I want to be your best friend so bad, Caitlin. Caitlin Otto, thank you so much, Caitlin. Or it might be Kathleen. There's a map. Nice. Listen, we are best friends. At least I thought so. <laughs> it's awkward when you guys tell me that you want to be my best friend because I have this idea in my mind that we are all best friends and that the shoddy bays are all a big group of best friends. So if you're telling me that that's not true, then this is really awkward. So thank you so much, Kathleen, for the kingdom of the curse. One, here comes to the two, to the three, to the four. Remember how earlier I told you that Maria is one of the best people I've ever met? Well, she also got me these. And it's Ashley Jade. I am excited to read these because Maria, she doesn't steer me in the wrong direction, you know? So she got me Fold. I need to point out that she got me um, a bookmark and it says, means so much to me, Larissa. I know this is small, but I had to send it to you. Love you, Maria. Maria, anything you send to me, I will cherish with my entire heart. Like anytime you guys write me notes or you guys write me letters or you get me little things, I have right there, you can't see it, but it's right there. A little shelf next to my computer and that's where I keep everything you guys send me. Um, except for the books. The books stay on my bookshelf obviously but like any bookmarks and notes and anything it goes in there. I will always keep it. I love it so much. Anything you send me honestly it means the world to me. I love this series. I know you would enjoy it. You're amazing. You validate all my crazy feelings about book. You get me girl. Enjoy Maria. You get me Maria. Be ready because I may or may not cry right now. Um, it says I don't know about you but I also finished the Addicted Calloway Sister series in December. <laughs> No, 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 absolutely no. I've been procrastinating starting the Like Us series because I never wanted to end. Hope you enjoy, Kayla. Kayla, Kayla, you getting me all of these means the entire world to me. The fact that you thought of me this much, thank you. Thank you so much. And she got me, y'all, some of the Like Us series. I'm so excited. The meadows, the cobalt, the hails, the hails, my favorite people. Kayla, I love you so much. Thank you for getting me the Like Us series. I'm so excited to read it, but I am dreading it too, because like you said, I don't want it to be over. Oh, my leg, y'all, it's dead. The sweetest pie. Juniper Hill, Juniper Hill, my baby, my motherfucking baby. This is one of my favorite books. Stephanie Perry's writing is phenomenal. I will never shut up about this book. And now I own it in paperback. No one talked to me. Larissa, thank you so much for always bringing me laughter and good books. You're a light in such a dark world. I hope this makes its way to you and brightens your day like you do for so many of us. Love, Katie. Katie, your notes are everything. Thank you, Katie. Thank you so much. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. I wish words could describe how much I love you guys. I really wish. These two 
are part of a series, How to Date a Douchebag. The Studying Hours is book one, and then The Failing Hours is book two. Ooh. The note for the first one says, hi from Italy. <gasps> hi. I wanted to thank you because you always put a smile on my face with your videos. You're amazing bestie from Mariana. Oh, thank you, Mariana. I'm so glad I could put a smile on your face. And from Italy, we love that. My last name is Italian, Campasano. Did you guys know that? Fun fact. I have Italian in my family. The next note says, you're my favorite and the reason I read Colleen Hoover, I'm on a year long book buying ban. So figured I'd buy you a book to fill the void. <laughs> Ely from Sydney. Oh, thank you so much, Sydney. Now listen, why are you in a year-long book buying ban? That is a really long time to not buy a single book. Excuse me. I say break that book buying ban. Go buy whatever book you want, girl. Life is way too short to be on a book buying ban. I said what I said. Sydney, Mariana, thank you so much. I love you guys endlessly. Thank you. I know a galaxy and I can take you for a ride. This is one of my favorite books. I really want to know your thoughts. It's different from your usual, but I love it so much. One of the reasons I'm reading again, so thank you. I still can't believe you haven't read from Blood and Ash though. Sophie, listen Sophie, I know, I know Sophie, I know. Anyway, it's all the missing girls. I love thrillers, I really do. When I went to romance, I never looked back, but I am excited. The Silent Patient is one of my favorites. It was one of the only books that's ever got me with a plot twist. Thank you Sophie for getting it for me. And I promise I'll get to from Blood and Ash. Eventually, Sophie. When? We're not sure, but eventually. Now, 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 the worst best man Mia Sosa, y'all. I know the note to this one because I'm not gonna lie. I read this book as soon as I got my hands on it. it. Says Larissa, love your energy and videos. You asked for a Brazilian MC and here she is. Hope you enjoyed this book as much as I did. Can't wait for your video on the Addicted series from Kayla. Lena in this book is Afro-Brazilian and I loved, that was my favorite part of the book, honestly. Like hearing the Portuguese, seeing the culture, getting representation. That was just everything to me in this book. And I loved that. The romance was obviously amazing too, but it just, that's what I focused on. <laughs> Thank you so much for getting it for me. I hope you enjoy the Addicted Calloway video. I will hopefully have another one eventually with spoilers. I'm just kind of giving it a break because I talk about Addicted Calloway so much. I don't want you guys to be bored. <laughs> anyway, thank you, Kayla. Thank you so, so much. I love you. I really need to read this book, okay, y'all? It's The Path of a Logical Liar. She encounters Grant in a coffee shop. <gasps> coffee shop in New York? That's an instant way to get my attention. Hey Larissa, just wanted to get you a book from your wish list as a thank you for getting me into reading. I have just started the off-campus series and all I can say is Garrett Graham <laughs> from Liberty. Welcome Liberty, thank you for getting me this book. Honestly, if you don't fall for Garrett Graham, y'all, are you even human? Thank you so much, Liberty. You're so welcome to be able to get you back into reading. That is what I'm here for. We love the Shoddy Base community, don't we? We do. So these are the last two books that came with notes. It is Sweet Possession by Jay Daniels and then Where Good Girls Go to Die by Holly Reid. <laughs> Not sure if you've read any of Holly's books, but this is the one that made me fall in love with her. And I think you'll love her too. Love your energy, never stop. At Let's Shave Kia. So I think her name is Kia. Holly Reen, I have never read any of her other books. I'm pretty sure. But I'm excited to read this series. I think I have the other two in the series too. And this one's also a series, I think. Sweet Possession. Hi, Larry. Is this mostly smut? Yes. Am I still obsessed with Dylan and Reese? Yes. Enjoy it, bestie. Going to start the Ravenhood trilogy this month. Wish me luck, Maria. Good luck, sweetie. So this will be when I'm in the mood for just a really smutty, quick read. I'll read this one. Thank you so much, Maria, for getting it for me. As for where good girls go to die, all the good girls go to hell. I'm very excited to read the Good Girls trilogy. Thank you so much for getting it for me, Kia. Okay, so the last books I have to show Shoddy Bays are ones that did not come with notes. So if you got me this, please let me know so I can thank you properly. But it's these right here, right here, right here. So the first one is Good Girl, Bad Blood, and it's the sequel to A Good Girl's Guide to Murder. Thank you so much for getting me this, whoever it was. Thank you. I'm very excited to read it when I'm in the mood for a thriller. Vipers and Rituals out. Oh my God, it starts on page 13. Oh my God, the book came messed up. Look, look at that. This is the first page. It starts right off on page 13. It didn't give me a dedication. It didn't give me chapter one. It gave me nothing. Excuse me, Amazon. The Monsters and Muses duet. So the first one is Promises and Pomegranate and the next one is this one, Vipers and Virtuoso. Okay, I don't know at all what it's about. It's about Aiden and Riley. Is it about the same people as the first book or is this two different couples? I'm not really sure. Whoever got me this one, thank you so, so much. I'm very excited to read Promises and Pomegranate and Vipers and Virtuoso. Then we have A Kiss for a Kiss by Helena Hunting. I have the rest of this series. So I'm very excited to have this one too. I think it's called the All In series and it's hockey. Yeah, Jake Masterson, single dad. I'll read it. Thank you so much for whoever got me a kiss for a kiss. Guess what? A kiss to you. Mwah. Then Skin of the Night. She's a law student in London. You know I love a London boy. I'm very excited to read this. Thank you so much to the shoddy bay that got me this. Thank you. I love you so much. Show yourself. Show yourself. 
<laughs> and lastly, Shadi Bay's a very important one, and that is bad reputation, but it's the new edition. I have um, whatever it takes and wherever you are, which is a separate one. This one is all together and it goes in chronological order. I'm I'm so excited. It's the oldest story in the world. One day you're 17 and planning for someday and then quietly and without you ever really noticing some days today and then some days yesterday and this is your life. One Tree Hill season nine, episode 13. My favorite show of all time. I have watched it exactly 14 times. I said what I said and I was planning a rewatch after I finished rewatching Jane the Virgin and Gossip Girl. I am gonna rewatch One Tree Hill. So 15 times the charm. Anyway, thank you so much to whoever got me this. Shadi Bays, thank you so much to every single one of you that got me books. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I wish I could express in words how much I love you and how thankful I am for you. That's why I try to do these videos because I feel like I can't just receive a book and like not come on a video and freak the hell out about it. I can't, I physically cannot do that. I'm so sorry if these videos are so long or if they bore you or anything like that because they are really long, but I always wanna thank you and make sure you know that you are so appreciated and none of this ever goes unnoticed. Thank you. If you get me a book and you don't see it, it's because I'm making a video with it, I promise. <laughs> these books, have been sitting there waiting for me to talk about them for four months. So that's why there are so many and that's why this video is so long. But I promise that now that I finally got caught up and I'm not so all over the place, I will start doing these videos every once um, once a month. Unless I don't have enough books, then I'll wait until the next month or something like that. But I will be doing these more often so that there aren't so many books to talk about all in one video. Like I said, I wasn't home. And when I posted the last one, I was already a little behind on the other ones. So it just all snowball affected me basically and I had to wait four months to film this. Now that we did this video I will continue to do these every month so if you get me a book you will see in a video for sure. Thank you so so much. I like don't know what I've done to deserve you guys but thank you. Thank you Shadi Bays. I love you. I'm sending you all the biggest hug in the entire world because I love you. Thank you for watching. I won't waste any more of your time because this was hella long. I'm so sorry but I love you. Thank you so much. I love you. Long days.